Former governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, Sanusi Lamido Sanusi, has warned that whoever succeeds President Buhari should be prepared for the onerous, the wondrous task of running the country, which is presently confronted with many challenges. He made this known in Abeokuta during his visit as the Khalifa of Tijaniya to Babala Dini of Egbaland, who's celebrating his 80th birthday. Tivos News Kazim Malowe reports. As Nigerians prepare for the 2023 elections, politicians, especially the presidential aspirants, have been advised to brace up and be ready to face the task ahead. Currently, politicians across political parties are warming up for the 2023 polls, but they have been told that running the affairs of the country requires a lot of sacrifice and determination. The 14th Emir of Kanu and former governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria gave this advice while speaking at a program in honor of Babanla Adini of Egbaland. He predicted that Nigeria may face more difficult times in 2023 and called on citizens to be ready to take tougher decisions in the interest of the country. But to be honest, this country has, we are living on extra time. In 2015, we were in a depot. In 2023, we will be in an even much deeper hole than in 2015. The challenges facing all those people who are struggling to be president, I hope they understand that the problems they are going to face are multiples of the problems that were faced in 2015. But the solution is not for all of us to jump into politics. This country needs polit good, good politicians. It needs imams and pastors and bishops who are going to stand up and remind them of the fear of god he also warned clerics to desist from collecting money to pray for politicians noting that the right thing to do is to first identify the best candidate and then pray for him he also denied eyeing the presidency in 2023 noting that he is contented being the spiritual leader of tijaniya in the country but to be khalifa tijaniya fi nigeria wa waraha it's an office that personally, given the choice between that office and the presidency, I would choose that office. We do not know what God will make of us. And we will accept whatever he makes of us, even if it is something we do not want. The event organized to honor Babanla Adini of Egbel and Tayo Shoumi was attended by notable Islamic scholars in Ogun State, including the chief imam of Egbeland and the leader of Muslim community in Southwest, Edo and Delta State. Kazim Olowe, TVC News, Abe Okuta.